Well, YouTube, the moment we've all been waiting for. Me, most of all. This thing is finally all together. And uh, will soon be for sale, actually. But, <clears throat> now for the all-important thing. I've uh, driven it around and uh, run it a little bit, but it would seem... Huh, it would seem that it has a random misfire. Now, I'm not bringing up any codes, or I wasn't at the last drive, but I've been fighting that misfire all day. It's got good compression, good spark, it's got fuel, the valves are all opening and shutting as they should be, everything's working right, but it's still got that misfire on the same cylinder. The only thing I noticed was that it... Uh, the only thing I noticed was that uh, when I pulled the intake off, it absolutely reeked of stale gas. But, uh, you know, it probably sat for two years, um, which normally, I mean, wouldn't make gas unusable, but would uh, be curious as to why it's missing on one cylinder instead of all six. At any rate, I'm going to show you how to check for codes on this particular car. You can see the odometer there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the key to the on, off, on, off, on, off, on. Okay. It's going to come up. That's the mileage number. Okay. Then you do it again. One, two, three. And it should... Yep. You can see it comes up as a P1684. And then done what it says there. The 1684 code just tells you that the battery has been unhooked within the last 50 starts. So once it gets started 50 times, it'll clear that code. So as you can see, it's not throwing any codes, but here is how it runs. Actually, other than that miss, it, uh, Sounds pretty good, you know. And like I said, other than that miss, you can even see the motors shaking a little bit. But it's this cylinder right here, whatever number that is. I'm not actually positive. And the only reason I know that is because if I unplug this coil pack, no change. Well, wait a minute. Now, for some reason, it just smoothed up. Wonder what the heck. No way. Yeah. It just smoothed up a lot. Well, hey. You guys witnessed a miracle here today. Miracle at the Wick Ranch shop. But boy, oh boy, am I going to be glad to have this thing out of here. Oh man, I'm so sick and tired of working on this Intrepid. If you ever have the opportunity to buy one of these cars, shoot yourself right in the testicles. If you have no testicles, do something equally severe. You will only be helping yourself. So, I guess, um... Huh, that's... Pretty cool, I guess. Huh. You know, it doesn't make any noise. When I had it up on the highway, it didn't overheat. I would call this another successful rebuild. Now we just got Charlie's other motor and maybe the Alice Chalmers and... Oh, jeez. The list goes on and on anyways. I'd bore you. But, yep. Another successful rebuild at any rate. We like it. Now I just got to get it into town and take it over to Hank's. 